Hey everybody, hello and good morning greetings from Monrovia, uh, Maryland. Once again today it is July 7th, 2018. Local time is 7-11 and uh, we are empty. We are located here at uh, Costco. Just delivered our uh, load. We are empty and headed for the yard. All right, after delivering at the yard, as I mentioned a couple of videos ago, I am heading, uh, after delivering at Costco, we're headed for the yard and uh, pick up preloaded trailer R74 bound for Costco in Dallas, Texas. Dallas, Texas from here is 1,340 miles by way of Hagerstown all the way down to Knoxville, Tennessee. Knoxville all the way down to West Memphis, Little Rock, Texarkana, and down to Dallas, Texas. Our scheduled delivery date and time is Monday at 6 a.m. First and foremost, I'd like to thank each and every one of you out there for uh, being kind to Jackie, Michelle, and, and uh, Jessica. They did their first live show and I think it went well. They, were, they looked like they were having fun. Thank you for participating in their adventure. Uh, 220. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, another load of uh, French bread successfully safely delivered. Thank you, Lord. Let me, uh, you can keep on watching this guy while I go in. Well. Yeah, let me go close my doors. I'll be right back. back and uh, we're headed for the yard local time is 721 
Oh, there's a brand new building right in front of us now. Boy, that popped up really fast. One of you made a comment yesterday. Hey, John, if you did three weeks of vacation, and you still know how to shift. <laughs> I know, right? I think that's what they call muscle memory. Time to answer some reoccurring questions. I get these questions all the time. Just got a message from the boss. Okay, head back to the yard. I'll be there shortly with key and tire. Nice. Recurring questions. The camera that I am using right now is a Sony HDR X3000. It's the 4K version, although I am only recording at 1080p 30. Um, editing software is iMovie by Apple on my iPad. Let's see, do I prefer automatic or manual? Uh, I do both, but I could, I'd rather prefer the automatic. I figured the automatic can shift a lot more efficient than I do. Dream truck, it would probably be a Kenworth W900. One of you asked also if I ever have met uh, Indiana Jack. Uh, no, I've never met any YouTubers out there except for Trucker Who, Captain Kevin, of course Larry. Uh, who else? That's it. I have driven all 48 states. I have been to Canada with my personal vehicle. Never drove a semi there. I've been to New York, Mexico border in Laredo, Texas, uh, just crossed into the border, walked across and came back. Raised in the Philippines, in the island of Mindanao, but I grew up in an island called Kamikin Island. My kids call me Tatay, T-A-T-A-Y means dad in uh, Filipino.
I started truck, in, truck driving back in 1990 or 91. I'm pretty sure it's 91. I went to a diesel truck driving school in Sun Prairie, Wisconsin, near Madison. My first truck driving job company was with CRST. They're out of Cedar Rapids, uh, Cedar Rapids, Iowa. But the office that I was assigned to was Shearerville, Indiana. And that's pretty much it. All right, we'll catch you guys later at the yard. As always, have a good and godly day. And thanks for watching. John, to be good here. Peace. All right, once again, welcome uh, to Frederick, Maryland. We are currently traveling on Interstate 70. And uh, we're about to get off at this exit 53A. Bypass 270 South towards Washington, D.C. We're only about, I don't know, three miles to the yard. We're not that far away. Town. Okay, welcome back to the yard, baby blue.
guess the boss ain't here yet. There's R74. See that envelope right there on the front? That's Larry's paperwork. Right there releases the uh, releases the fifth wheel, and no, you cannot release the fifth wheel while you're driving down the road. <coughs> Safety feature is these two, or actually this one, needs to be pulled out before this functions.
that's it. how wide this thing is it's not as wide as the whole thing right things I gotta do today is to take that off my boss will then give me a brand new tire brand new trailer tire and this one has to be uh, replaced we're gonna replace it down the road today or tomorrow or Monday so I better slide the tandems all the way to the back. Let's do that. some air on the uh, trailer tanks before I could pull the pin out so I'll be right back peace okay I have been filling the uh, trailer air tanks so that we can use the pneumatic contraption here to, so that we can slide our tandems all the way to the back and give us room to work and get that trailer uh, trailer tire out of there right should still be out.
because I did not push in the trailer uh, brake release. Let's get the trailer tire out. Now is wait for the boss. I'll catch you later. Peace. Well, my boss just came by. It turns out uh, he did not have a spare tire at the house. So I ended up putting the uh, tire back on the tire rack. The good news is I was able to give him my uh, morning delivery bill of lading this morning uh, also I was able to give him Larry's paperwork you know what we should do and he also dropped drop off the uh, spare key so now I have two keys one for the ignition and one for my pocket what else is there? Uh, so let's light the tandems uh, forward a little bit. I still did not release the trailer uh, brake, so the pins are still in. Uh, here's what I usually do. I slide the tandems as far forward as I can. Look for a reference point in the ground on the ground and then uh, just pull up a little bit now I don't have to worry about the weight because this is a very very light load load of bread so can't be that heavy now, this is the trailer handbrake, 
lock that up, go forward or reverse. Forward. And that should do it. There you go. Only that it doesn't even have twelve thousand pounds. Eesh, that's really light. Set at minus one, set at zero. Current temperature is minus one. And our load gauge here is at 26,000. So we're good to go. Dallas, here we go. Oh, guess what? Long Haul Larry, aka I call him Super Trucker Larry has made it himself to go to Moorfield, West Virginia for the very first time. And uh, he was a little bit skeptical of how to get up there because the GPS had him go all over the place. So guess what Larry did? The mighty super trucker Larry asked Johnny be good for advice. Imagine that, me giving Larry an advice. From what I heard from the boss, he did make it. He got loaded. So. And I'm sure he's picking up the uh, uh Picking up in Moorfield, delivering to Shawano, Wisconsin. You know what? I gotta use the loo, so I'll be right back. Don't go anybody nowhere. Peace. All right, here we go. Dallas, Texas. Here we come. Local time is 8.42. Temperature here in Frederick, Maryland is 68 degrees. Again, today it is July 7th, 
2018. Dallas, Texas is now at 1,333 miles. By the way, that route is taking 15 south, which I might just do. I might just do that instead of taking 70 to 81 south. Those of you who are new to the channel, if you're ever wondering if I've been to a certain state or city, uh, just type in on YouTube search JBG Travels, whatever city or state you're thinking of. For example, some of you are asking, have I ever been to San Francisco or have I ever been to Portland, Oregon? So just type in JBG Travels, Portland, Oregon, and a few should uh, pop up. I don't think I've ever, I don't, I know for a fact I do not have any videos on uh, San Diego. I've been to San Diego maybe about three or four times and that was way before YouTube uh, ever existed.
New Haven, Connecticut, or JBG Travels, Miami, whatever state, particular cities or places. take 15 south Catch you guys later. As always, thank you so, so very much for watching. My family and I are ever, ever grateful to you guys. Each and every one of you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Have a good and godly day. Stay tuned for more JBG Travels Trucking Adventures. Peace.